What do we mean when we talk about concrete cover? Well, concrete cover is the distance into which a steel bar is embedded inside a concrete structure. So it's that distance there or that distance there as an example to this bar. There are two reasons why we have concrete cover. The first reason is because the steel bar has to be bonded to the concrete. So therefore, of course, it needs to be immersed inside the concrete structure. The second reason has to do with durability of the steel bar. If this steel bar were left outside and it had rain on it and some salts, it would corrode very, very quickly. So we have to prevent that. Therefore, it has to be embedded inside the concrete structure, which we know is an alkaline environment, and that prevents it, prevents it from uh, corroding, and that's why there has to be cover to that steel bar. So how much cover do we need on a reinforced concrete beam? Well, that really depends on the harshness of the environment in which the concrete beam has been placed. So, as a good example, if we have a, a reinforced concrete road bridge, for instance, if it's in a cold climate, then what will happen is when it snows, the trucks will come out and will put um, de-icing salts all over the bridge. And you can imagine salt in an environment where we have steel reinforcing bar is not necessarily a very good combination. And so the cover which we require in those sorts of structures where the environment is very harsh can be 50 millimetres, that depth, or, or even more, even higher than that. Conversely, if we have a reinforced concrete beam which is inside a building, that's different. That's a less harsh environment, and then covers are lower. And it could be in a ballpark of something like 25 millimetres, for instance, as a sensible cover uh, within those sorts of structures.